Hi, I'm Alexa, and welcome to The Leftovers. Over the past several years, Northampton students have been actively using their voice to protest sexual harassment. SASH, or Students Against Sexual Harassment, have recently integrated into Jackson Street Elementary School. We sat down with Maya and Eliza to discuss how these elementary school students have used art to express their voice. It has become, uh, I would say something else. Mm -hmm. um, there's definitely an aspect of Students Against Sexual Harassment, but I would say it's more uh, students against being silenced is maybe what we'll kind of start thinking of it as because I think a lot of young people's voices need to be heard, especially um, that are, you know, not quite tweens, not quite teens. I think that teaching kids in this certain creative way uh, will help them in the future because um, I think there's a way that many adults, not to shame on any adults, but uh, look at this kind of thing and say, well, what can we teach these kids by, you know, the book? And um, I don't think that that's where to go. I don't think uh, calling out teenage boys and teenage girls and saying, like, that's not okay, shame on you, and kind of, like, smacking them on the hand, I don't think that's a way to address this problem. So this program that we're doing at Jackson Street, um, where we work with elementary schoolers with music, improv, art. I think there are two main things that I feel most strongly about how this strategy will really help them. The most important one, in my opinion, is just the fact that they are getting to speak with and become friends with older students. And the second reason, I think, is to be able to express your ideas and communicate with others through art and like creatively is a skill I think will become more and more important as uh, kids grow up. SASH is starting a new session for their after school program January 14th. If you're interested in joining, make sure to contact Maya Mince Cocoludo or Eliza Stewart Smith. This was The Leftovers. Thanks for watching.